What's going on guys? God bless you. Carlos here <clears throat> with Serrano's Mobile Detail in Dallas, Texas. Happy Sunday guys. Thank you so much for joining me in today's video. Uh, my voice is a little bit raspy. Last night, Yesterday we had our, uh, our fifth grade boys soccer game. So it was a very fun one and obviously I do a lot of screaming I guess at the games. I need to work on that. <laughs> Uh, but anyways, um, 2021 Yukon AT4. This thing is a bad beast. Um, 69 miles on it, guys. 69 miles. Literally, the customer said, I'm picking it up from the dealership, dropping it straight to your house. And here we have it. Um, what are we going to be doing on this vehicle? Or what are you doing on a 69-mile car? Um you know, uh, long story short, we're going to be doing a three-year ceramic coating on the paint. We're doing a very light polish uh, on the uh, vehicle. Thank God there is not a lot of defects on the car. So that's what we're going to be doing as well as an interior detail. Now, many guys are going to be like, what? You know, but customer wanted to get a little bit of a nice uh, shine or a nice, just a nice look um so hey uh that's what we're gonna be doing is an, an interior detail on it i'm gonna bring you guys in so you guys can see it but <clears throat> before i start this video when you get a customer guys you know uh and usually a customer says man it's brand new i don't need a i don't need a pro i don't need a wax i don't need a sealant um i don't need a ceramic coating it's brand new though the though their answer is true it's a brand new car it should have some sort of protection right but unfortunately vehicles nowadays they come with very minimal protection you can literally hit this with water and the paint is already flat um, therefore making that you know in an accurate um, conversation with the customer and that's where you come in and you explain to them you know hey I understand you have a brand new car but you want to get it protected right now you know when they say when is the best time to protect my car today right now right uh, that is when you really want to protect the, the paint is as soon as they get it uh, that way you can protect it and we have some hot months coming up and we reach temperatures up to like 120 here in august july so you want to protect your investment right off the bat so that's what uh, i usually tell customers you know i don't like to sell i don't do selling uh i just like i said it in a couple posts i create curiosity right i've been posting uh, over uh, a good while, you know, I post ceramic coating uh, jobs I've done. I post waxes that I've done, ceilings that I've done, but I never say, call me, book today. I just post the pictures, a little bit of what I did, and that's it, right? Uh, and I guess after so much, it, you know, customers start to realize that you mean business, and I mean business, guys. So I'm going to pull it out to the back. We're going to do a strip wash. We're going to do a very light clay because there's nothing on this paint. But you always want to make sure, especially when you're doing ceramic coatings, you want to make sure you do everything properly the right way so you don't miss anything. And the results will come out better when you don't skip steps. So that's what we're going to be doing. I'm going to take it around the back. Let me show you guys real quick how it looks. And we'll get to work on it. We are going to be doing an interior detail when i do detailing guys especially when it's a brand new car i always tell the customers are you sure you need a detail because it's brand new but the customer wanted it detailed and that's what we're gonna do obviously uh, we're gonna do a lot of it's mostly gonna be steam cleaning no crazy products chemicals it's literally gonna be steam clean and then we're gonna put a dressing on there so i'm still debating what dressing to put the customer wants gloss so i want to give them the best gloss but at the same time just kind of protect the uh the interior a little bit um so overall it's really good <clears throat> just dusty from them getting on it beautiful seats everything about this car is so beautiful um but we're gonna do a full interior detail on this get it nice and clean dress all the interior as he wants and then we're gonna start the coating process so it should be fun i probably won't record the interior detailing because there's not really much to do um and then we're gonna debadge we're gonna remove this wood Sorry, James Wood, we're taking you off. Our 
Pretty much, I am done with the polishing stage. We are now doing like the final touches. And as you can see, my son is actually helping me today. He came in and have him over the weekend. So um, it's one of those where it kind of sucks I have to work on a Sunday, but I'm uh, you know enjoying the quality time with him out here. He's not minding being out here in the heat. Uh, so what he's doing now is uh, polishing all of this uh, grill really nice with the uh, Max Shine Mini Tool. And he's doing really good actually. Uh, this this grill it's looking really. Did you get up here, Bobby? Mm -hmm. Up here. Oh, up here. And the best way, guys, to actually use this tool is kind of hold it like a pencil. Um, you hold it like a pencil. You want me to scoot your? Let me get up. Right there. So you hold it like a pencil, guys, and you just go around polishing every area uh, overall this paint came out really nice the gloss is definitely uh, popping now on this on this Yukon but we are to the finishing stages actually and uh, once I'm done with this I'm gonna pull it inside real quick just let the paint um, cool down and we're gonna start the ceramic coating but we're gonna be using T3 uh, from Dallas Paint Correction. And it should look really good. Nice. Very really nice, all right. Now all we're gonna do guys is just wipe it off and this grill will be ready. We are we are back. Uh, my son has been very curious uh, since I started, and and uh, he's he's been helping me. So thank you for helping me today puppy yeah. um, but he's been very excited I guess uh, when I told him about ceramic coating and I guess he's never really seen it firsthand so I'm gonna show him a little bit of what does daddy do on on a daily whenever we coat so we're also using t6 plus guys so this one um, is gonna show my son a little bit of the flashing um, and this is his first time obviously close supervision I'm watching it, so buddy thing that we're gonna mess up the customer's car. So very close supervision. So all right, puppy. So here we go. We're using T6 Plus. All you gotta do is apply it like this. And then I'm gonna do this area right here real quick, puppy, so you can see a little bit of how it works. And you always wanna do it in small sections, okay? In small sections, you will see, and I'll show you what is that we are looking for with this coating so how do how do we know when it's ready this one should flash and what i mean by flashing you will see it kind of turn into like a little rainbow effect and that is how we know let me close the garage real quick bear with me guys i don't want to make it too noisy all right so you guys can clearly see a little bit of where I coated. So you can see the 50-50. So you see how it's starting to turn more like yeah. dry. Then it'll slowly start getting, like you'll see it like rainbowish, like. Yeah, it's like darker over here and more brighter. Yes. So we are waiting for the flash time. And then my son's gonna do one part, so. Um, So I just give it a couple more seconds. As it flashes, 
you can still it's still a little bit wet but if you look over here Bobby look over here you see how you see this right here oh, yeah. you see how that's turning the yeah. color what how does it look like to you It's like, I don't know how to like describe it. Like oil? Yeah, it's like greasy oil. Greasy oil, okay, so that's what we're looking for. All right, so we're looking for that. So if you look down here, you can see it? Yeah. That is a flash right there. If you see it all the way up, you see those colors? Yeah. That means it's flashing. So grab your towel, give me one second. Let me bring you guys in real quick. And I hope you guys can see the flashing. So here we go, this is from, we're gonna go up and you can see the flashing all right there going up. I don't know if the camera can catch the quality of it, but it is flashing right there. there goes my son. Oh yeah, that's good. All the way down, bring it. So you're gonna bring it all the way across, go up. And you're gonna catch this edge real nice like this and then fill it in. You're gonna fill that box in. There you go, fill it in. Nice. Perfect. All right. So now we're gonna wait for the flash time. So now yeah, it's just a waiting game. The difference right here. Do what? You can see the difference right here. Um, once it's re once it's done already, and then um, once you apply, you can see a huge difference. Yeah. More. It looks more brighter, huh? Yeah. Brighter and then darker. All right, you can take your mask off if you want so you can breathe. All right, so now we are to the flashing stage, guys. So we're gonna wait for this baby to flash. And you can definitely start seeing the product flash already. All right, obviously under humidity. I have a small AC going in here just to kind of cool it down a little bit. Um, the humidity is a little bit high. So the flashing will be very quickly, um, but if you keep an eye on it, that's all you gotta do. Keep an eye on it and then blend it in, buff it off, and you should be okay, guys. So this new T6 Plus formula, it's freaking amazing, um, and I really like it. It becomes real slick after uh, the curing time. So let's uh, let's check it out. How do it look? They come from here, they both look the same. Yeah. This right here, they both look the same, but just a little bit better right here. Over here, you can still see a huge difference, kind of. Yeah. Getting blended a bit. Right, this part so it needs a like little blended. bit more right here, and it should be ready. So with T6 Plus, guys, just you know, it's, it just just wait for I, this one. I love it because you get to wait for the flashing. It's something that everybody loves to see. Is the rainbowing? It's the flashing. So um, this was just a good little you know experience with my son, and we can kind of do a little bit of bonding. Uh, I know many times I'm busy and, and you know I don't spend a lot of time with him but this has been a really uh, cool experience to uh, work with him and learning a little bit of what I do. This whole area is like already blended. Right here it's kind of different. It kind of looks like if you put glue on your arm and then you start peeling it off that's kind of how it looks right here. Yeah. All right go ahead and get your towel puppy. It's already flashing, so you don't want to wait too long. So go ahead and blend it in. Just blend it in. Perfect. Blend it in. All right. Blend it in nicely. It feels kind of grabby, huh? Yeah. Perfect. All right. And then there you go. And now you're going to buff it off and just kind of do it like in like circular motions. So when you do it, just kind of do it like this. Keep the two towels together always and just grab it nice and nice and firm and then just blend it in like that. Yeah, they, okay. they look the same now. Right, all right, yeah. go ahead and blend it in. Give it. That definitely has changed the color drastically. This feels more smoother now? Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. All right. You can feel the difference. Whenever we were, um, we were just starting, it felt like more like grip and like grip. 
But now it just feels smooth when you just go across like this. Yeah, awesome. Well, there you go, guys. There you have it. Application, first time application of T6 Plus with my son. Um, it has been truly an amazing weekend with my son. Uh, obviously, he goes back home today. He has school tomorrow. But it has been an amazing, uh, just an amazing time with my son. Uh, so, it's truly, it's, it's an honor. I mean... Just, just for him to see a little bit of what I do on a daily um, and all the blood and sweat that goes into a paint correction. <laughs> Definitely sweat. <laughs> but uh, he enjoyed it. I'm going to finish this car off, guys. Once I finish it, I'll bring you guys in for the final look. And, you know, with a uh, maybe a final reveal, we'll see. Uh, so you guys have a blessed day, and uh, I'll be back later on. Such a beautiful car. Alrighty guys, so here you have it. Uh whoops. Alrighty. With airbags, I don't know, this thing sounds like it has airbags. Guys, here he is. The 2021 AT4. Such a beautiful color and vehicle overall. I haven't seen many of these again, but we overall, overall we did a one-step paint correction. We did a three-year ceramic coating on it with the interior on a brand new 70 miles is all it has. Um, so overall, it came out really nice. Let me give you guys a walk around uh, so you guys can really get an up close every time i do videos it's always overcast when i do like these types of work which kind of frustrates me because it doesn't really show the the color of it but anyways let me get the camera give you guys a walk around and we'll get ready for the reveal all righty guys so here is the final look on this beautiful at4 Come on, son, come out. <laughs> the gloss is uh, insane, to be honest. It got more glossy with the coating. But it really came out amazing overall. Got everything. Sheesh. So beautiful. Really, really nice, guys. Um... But anyways, let me show you the interior real quick. And for the interior, we did a full steam cleaning all on the inside. Customer wanted a nice gloss. So this is aqua gloss, uh, four to one. All on the interior except the dashboard. But other than that, everything got uh, a nice gloss overall. Really, really nice. I love this vehicle the way it came out overall really nice guys so i may need to look into this car <laughs> anyways we have a drive auto appearance tire dressing wheel wells cleaned up all the way to get that nice clean 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 new look but i am super stoked i can't wait for the customer to arrive and pick it up today is monday i started on this sunday with my son again carlitos thank you puppy for your help you did amazing uh but uh i had a vehicle this morning today is monday so um i did that vehicle in the morning came back gave it the finishing touches on this car but overall it's been a great project so stay tuned for the final reveal really pretty holy cow heck yeah that's awesome looks totally different i mean not totally different but you can totally it's real Damn, slick. Have to hot, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Such a nice car. Time up in here, Mom? It's gonna look cleaner in my truck now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have the dirty vehicle to drive. <laughs> yeah, I was noticing like it has the um, the GMC lights at the bottom, like mm -hmm. it glows. 
Yeah, actually that the one that pops up down here, if you put your foot on it, it opens the That's a, early when well yesterday uh when I was watching nice have it. I hope this video uh you guys enjoyed it. I had a blast with my son again. Carlitos, thank you so much for your help, puppy. Uh customer loved it. And it was truly a uh, really nice car to work on, to be honest. So, again, thank you guys for the uh, support. Thank you for watching today's video. And I'll see you guys on the next video.